Hey from rjpassini.com. The reason I'm making this video, I have a few items I'm going to be putting up on eBay and I just wanted to share it with you and give you a little demo on it. This is a shock TV, flat screen, uh, I believe it's a liquid crystal display screen. And I'm just going to go over it uh, pretty briefly, but enough where you can see it does work. First thing I want to show you is the measurements and I'm going to use a, one of those rubbery, uh, what do you call it, tape measures just to show you, give you some measurements here. <clears throat> I know they measure these, measure these diagonally, but I'm just going to show you like this for now. As you can see, whoops, sorry about that. You can see over here, it's roughly about 12 inches. Whoops, sorry about that, folks. Right about nine, and diagonally, this is what you got here. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. Okay, the other thing is with this TV, um, its overall dimensions is uh, about 19 inches in length and the height is roughly about the same as about, about 12 so I hope that helps you and the thickness of it is roughly about three and a half inches no maybe close to four inches three and a half between three and a half and four inches okay um, it, it tilts I don't want to play around with it, but it does tilt up and down like that. And I got two cords here. And two cords. One is the power. And this one here, if you do buy this TV, you're the lucky bidder of this TV, um, you're going to need a converter box. And I'm going to show you that in a second. But um, I'm going to plug this in, the power adapter. So it's going to give me a second here, and I'll be right with you, folks. Okay, folks, I'm back. Um, here's where the uh, cable went to the coax, you know, the, uh, the adapter back here. Of course, this plug pops out and goes in that direction there. Um, you got a whole bunch of little settings here, I guess, for if you want to add, I guess, speakers or some kind of a system to it. But you got these things back here, these other adapters or connectors. Here, you, you have um, power, you got the power input menu channel and volume, excuse me. <clears throat> so, I'm going to power it up. Now, the only thing is though, with this microphone, or with this with this remote, um, power doesn't turn it on. You have to turn it on manually. I don't know, everything else seems to work on it. So, we're gonna, I'm going to show you that in a second. And I'm going to cut these lights out so you can see the TV does work. Okay. And I'm going to power it on manually. You want to make some money? Yes. On web. Um, As you can see, it does it's work. <laughs> and uh, it's got the different modes. See, it gets brighter. It goes down like that. Okay. You can see, see it works. Um, it does, if it mutes it. Okay, it does mute it. Um, it's got stereo mono. You can see that there on the bottom over there. Okay, but again, now here's the power button. Now watch, I'm going to show you. It doesn't work. It's funny. It doesn't work. Um, there's fresh batteries in there, and I know there's fresh batteries. I'm going to mute this so you can hear me. Um, there are fresh batteries in here, and it does work. Um, you know, function-wise, it does. Um, let's see. Uh, the volume. Let's see which one's the volume. Uh, the volume. I guess we mute. You can't. Right, so let's People go here. Unable right here. to work. Pay attention to the following I message. This is the volume. Right if here. you're one of the millions of Americans sorry, folks, who are disabled with me for one and unable here. to work, you may be entitled um, to disability benefits through go. Social Security. So it's on the bottom there. The volume. Receiving benefits is your right if you yeah, suffer right. from a physical or mental disability. Whether you're see, applying you for the first time works. or you've um, already been denied. I'm we going to power this off for a second, though. Up with an right. advocate but you can see, as you can see, it works. So I, just, I, I can't tell you more than that. It does work. And it works. And the only reason why it's working is because I used it with a, a digital converter box. If you have cable, then you probably don't need the converter box. But um, if you are the, per, you know, the bidder of this here, you're going to need, you know, uh, well, this takes uh, two AAA batteries back here, which are not included with this, of course. Um, or if you want to invest in the uh, in a new remote, like I said, it works. This works. Just the power button will turn on. So I guess that could be a little, you know, a little problem in that respect, especially if you sit down on the couch or whatever. But once you turn it on, you got the remote to go through the channels. Uh, I'm just gonna show you the 
the digital box I have, in case you're not familiar with it. I'm going to pan the camera over there. Okay. All right. And as you can see, that's the box I use. That that is not included, of course. This is working off of uh, an outside digital TV antenna. Uh, so that's what that's what I'm using right now to power up a TV I'm using. But you're going to need to buy that digital box if you don't want to use cable. So um, basically, that's all I can tell you in that part there. Again, that's not included, uh, nor is a cable. What you will be getting, I'm just going to pan this back again, what you will be getting with this unit is, like I said, the remote control and the TV itself with the power cord. There's no original packaging, no user manual. Um, it will be packaged safe and securely to get it to you in one piece. <laughs> so um, if this is all I can tell you about this TV. Uh, the reason why I did the demo is to show you it does work. Um, I do demos when it comes to electronics in certain cases because I want the buyer to see that it's working. You know, I mean, taking a picture of it, not being plugged on or actually in use. Uh, to me, as a seller, if I was to buy something like that, I would like to have that there. I'm not saying all the buy other sellers on eBay do that, but I like to do it this way. You know, this way you know what you're getting ahead of time. You know, uh, and that's basically it. If you have any questions on this on this TV. Um, please email me at rjpassini at verizon.net and I'll be more than happy to answer your questions. And thank you very much for stopping by. Have a great day now. Thanks again. Bye now.